I'm Johnny Bradsfield and we're in downtown Colorado Springs. Why don't you take a second and get away from all this social media stuff and check out some good stuff. The Green Line Grill, a premier spot for burgers tucked away in the heart of downtown Colorado Springs and one of many locally owned businesses thriving in the face of adversity. With the severe limitations on indoor business, they took the party outside by way of food truck. So we got a chance to sit down with the owner and innovator of this establishment. I'm Bobby Couch, owner of the Green Line Grill, and as of this week, we've been here seven years. Wow, seven years, okay. So when you first started this place, what was like the main inspiration to start this place? Uh, I was tired of working for everybody else. Right. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, truly, this is the staple of what we do is from my hometown in Oklahoma, the onion fried burger legacy from back in the Great Depression. Okay. So I thought we'd bring that up here and, and see how the town felt about it. I've been I've been here a couple I've been here a couple times and it's, your burgers are just so on point that it's like it's hard to find that sort of good burger around because everything just feels so fast and like let's just get it out or I got to pay thirty dollars for it and it just tastes like something I could have made at home but like when you come here I just feel like you guys really have that that home cooked like you know the the grill yeah, absolutely. You know. the home style cooking without being at your house right <laughs> right what would you say your biggest obstacle with this place has been? Uh, actually, I, you know, I don't look at I don't look at much as an obstacle. I mean, you always got trials and tribulations, such as our recent score of events. Mm -hmm. uh, our hood vent went out. We had a fire. You know, you name it, it happens. It's about your day-to-day -day perseverance and right. moving forward with I don't know who you are inside. Right. <laughs> So is that what kind of keeps you going? Yeah. Uh, to... yeah, everything keeps me going. It's the challenge of every day that keeps me going. <laughs> right. <laughs> what would you say has been your biggest thing for the community and what has been the biggest thing the community has done for you? <sighs> that is a pretty big one. Um, I don't know, every week I'm out doing something. I mean, we do Hillside Gardens every week. It's a local community and a, a music event. Mm. Um, we cook burgers down there. We hang out down there. I mean, they are our community. We live here. Um, as far as our community helping us, if you put out a, if you put out a call, people will come and help you. I mean, yeah. that's just who it is. I mean, everybody supports everybody in, the, in our little circle that we have down here in our little part of downtown Colorado right. Springs. Um, it works out pretty good. Do you have like one standout moment where it's just like, wow, this is where you take a step back and you're like, I can't believe we've well, gotten here. Yeah. We, we win so many awards every year that, I mean, it's all, it's all, uh, it's, it's all a big smile. Yeah. <laughs> was, the, was the first award the best one or is it just the more, is it like, nah, well, we're getting ring number six this year? No. I mean, I, I've actually got past all that where it's, it's yeah. like, yeah, it's, it's still cool and it's still fun and enjoyable. It's a nice thank you, mm -hmm. but. You know, we don't do it for that. We never did it for that, but it's it's just, you know, that's also part of the community part. Right. You know, so okay. it's, it's, it's all wonderful. <laughs> cool, cool, cool. After our sit down, I knew I had to get my hands on another one of these amazing burgers. Look at that thing. I know you're jealous. I can see it in your face. Look at my face. That thing is delicious. And that's good stuff.